Amid the chaos of the Battle of the Blackwater, Sansa Stark managed to escape King's Landing with the Hound. However, their journey together was not without its complexities. The Hound, a brutal and hardened man, initially protected Sansa with the intention of ransoming her back to the Starks. Along the way, however, a bond began to form between them, and he started to view Sansa as more than just a means to an end. In his eyes, she became like a little sister. Their journey eventually led them to encounter the Stark forces. The Hound, torn between his desire to collect the ransom and his newfound affection for Sansa, made the difficult decision to deliver her safely back to her brother, Rob. However, upon their arrival, Rob was filled with anger and threatened to execute the Hound for his past actions, believing Sansa to be a mistreated prisoner of the infamous Hound. It was then that Sansa stepped in, vouching for the Hound's role in rescuing her from the clutches of the Lannisters. Moved by Sansa's plea, Rob reconsidered his initial decision and offered the Hound a place in his army, recognizing his skills as a warrior. With no other options and enemies looming to the south, the Hound reluctantly accepted Rob's offer. He knew that joining the Northern Army was his best chance at survival and of the bloodshed that he always craved. As a member of the Northern Army, the Hound quickly proved his worth. His fierce and brutal fighting style made him a valuable asset on the battlefield. With each victory, his reputation grew, and he became known as one of the most fearsome warriors in the Northern Army. In one particular battle, the Hound found himself joining forces with Edmure Tully's troops. The Mountain and his men stood in their path, threatening to turn the tide of the war. The Hound, driven by his desire for vengeance against his older brother, seized the opportunity to confront the Mountain once and for all. The battle between the Hound and the Mountain was brutal and intense. The two brothers clashed, their swords meeting with deadly force. The Hound fought with a ferocity born from years of resentment and pain, while the Mountain relied on his immense size and strength. The outcome of the battle would determine the fate of the war. In the end, the Hound emerged victorious. His relentless determination and skill proved to be the deciding factor. The Mountain fell before him, and with his defeat, the balance of power shifted in favor of the North. The news of the Hound's victory spread throughout the land and his reputation as a formidable warrior only grew. His loyalty to the Starks and his unwavering dedication to their cause earned him the respect of both the soldiers and the people. Rob, recognizing the Hound's immense value, offered him a prominent position within his army and a place in his Kingsguard. The Hound, now bonded to the Starks by bloodshed and sacrifice, accepted the offer. He fought alongside Rob, becoming one of his most trusted and fearsome soldiers. As the war raged on, the Hound's presence on the battlefield became a symbol of hope for the North. His brutal strength and unwavering loyalty inspired those around him, and his victories bolstered the morale of the Northern forces. In the end, the Hound's brutal fight against the Mountain became legendary. His triumph turned the tide of the war, leading the North to victory. Sansa, now a strong and just princess, carried the memory of the Hound with her, forever grateful for his protection and the bond they had formed. The Hound's name would be remembered in the annals of history, and particularly those in the North, a testament to his brutal strength and the unlikely alliance that arose from the ashes of war.